we're back and we're talking about carbs. If you haven't seen part one, make sure you go back and watch it. When you see carbohydrate, that includes three things, fiber, sugar, and starch. Fiber's pretty good. It doesn't raise your blood sugar levels and it helps with digestion. Sugar is composed of two things, naturally occurring sugars, there's six grams of naturally occurring sugar, and then added sugar. This is what's added during the production process. What's left on the label would be considered starch. Here's the quick math. 34 grams minus four grams of fiber minus six grams of total sugars leaves us with 24 grams of starch. Now, what's the difference between total sugars and starches? Total sugars are already in its simplest form. Those are gonna get directly absorbed into your bloodstream. The starches, those are long chains of sugar molecules that are gonna get broken down in your body and turn into sugar. So even though starches aren't sweet, your body still treats them like sugar once they're digested. So if we ignore the fiber, so 34 minus four, that's 30 grams of sugar and starches that your body will absorb and utilize. But remember, 30 grams times four is 120 grams of carbs, also known as sugar, in this container. And that is why serving size matters. Labels love to play math games. Trust me, I know.